Okay, today I want to talk about the uh, the Mozilla add-on, the, the Firebug. And um, you just type in Google Firebug and it'll get you to this page right here. So uh, the Firebug is a great uh, add-on to the, the Firefox browser. Uh, you just add it on, you don't even have to restart the browser. Um, what it is is a great tool to learn how uh, how to write, how to, you can edit, debug, and monitor CSS, HTML, and JavaScript live in any web page. So it's a way of adjusting the code and seeing how other people code, um, copying code, all kinds of different things you can do with the um, the Firebug uh, application or the add-on to the uh, Firefox browser. How it works is um, you start a web page, let's say my website, and um, you just turn it on. Usually it's up here in the upper corner. Some of the uh, old, older versions is down in the lower um, right corner right here. But it looks like a little bug in the corner after you, you, you install it. And once you click on it, it kind of puts this kind of uh, um, window over top of your web page. And I have a really small monitor, so... Um, um, it's it it's it's kind of covering almost everything you see here, but it kind of adds on to your page, and you can see you can move it around and things like that. Now, well, basically, what you can do is you can open up the code, and you can see all the code for the website is right down here. And as you move your cursor over top of certain areas, it'll highlight it. Like I'm using a, a lot of div tags, and we're learn a lot about div tags and things like that, and uh, things like this code in in this class. And as I roll over, you can see it's highlighting the different parts. You can open it up, and it'll, it'll, you can see the code that I used. Um, and so it shows you all the code that is in in a web page. Okay, so you can see each and every one. Oh, that's probably not the best code right there, but uh, that's under the HTML. And then there's a console area that I don't have turned on right now. Then the CSS. It shows you all the CSS that was written for this page. Okay. And you could simply copy and paste if you want. If I wanted, oh, I want to try this CSS myself, I can hit the control C and paste it into some kind of um, text or HTML editor. Um, there's a Firebug options over here, which has a pull down menu, which allows you to, to um, um, add things, show things, delete things, remove things. So there's a whole bunch of things. And there's, a, there's like the editor that I was just talking about. Um, as you move things around, you can see see it'll highlight things. There's a script editor, the DOM for showing you uh, different programming in JavaScript that you might have used on your web page. And .NET is the is the the, the uh, Microsoft kind of programming, and of course cookies is a way of controlling data on a page. So um, you can have uh, this Firebug. You should just try it. Watch some of the videos that I provide. Um, it'll show you different ways of doing things. The best is the HTML and as you roll over there's ways of having it highlight things as you can see as you highlight your code and again you can copy and paste from this program into other programs. If you don't want it to be on you can turn it off by clicking the little X here. You can undock it here if you want it in a new window that way you can sort of put it over to the side anywhere as you're working on a page and um, um, it's a great little uh, add-on that will help you learn the code uh, a little better. Again, it's called uh, Firebug.